Hello, my beautiful Sagittarians. Welcome to your mid-month reading. Mid-month energies for all of you. Sun, Moon, Rising Signs and Venus. Let's see loves. Mid-August. Since we are almost into a full moon as well. No retrograde, it's still quite strong. But yes, this month is like no other. Let's see here, Sagittarius, what we need to know, what we need to embrace, what we need to go forward with. Always, always know it's a general energy that might resonate, might not much. Let's see, darlings. We have an Eight of Swords underneath. Three of Pentacles. We have Five of Swords, Page of Cups, and we have a Tower, and a Queen of Pentacles. Okay, some of you Sagittarius, in this time period, there is some help coming in for you, related to a matter you are into right now. For example, if you are in your work environment don't really get along with certain people or something is going on in your work environment there is some type of help coming in for some of you this this help could come in the form of finances for others of you in the form of um, a promotion for others of you even to switch what you do right now for some of you, even you can have a new job offer. For some reason, you, you don't understand what's going on around you or how the things are. But this tower doesn't come just like that. Because this is something quite majorly coming in for you. And it's kind of soon you understand why certain things are going away or why other things needs to be worked on or fixed on. It's not like you are at the crossroads, but there's something here coming ahead that you, you're probably not in, even in the wildest dreams knowing or seeing it. Let's see loves what this is about. The first card we have, the King of Cups. So somebody here, it's offering you some help. Absolutely. Ace of Pentacles, or this help could be in a form of um, an advice, a suggestion, guidance, or even financial help. Yes, but I feel here, whatever here is given to you is gonna multiply. It's going to come even stronger and more and more. I feel here some of you might not want to, to get this help or you have a hard time to accept help. We have a fool and we have the Empress. Wow! So it couldn't be a better energy. For some of you, you are the one who find the solution. Because definitely there is a solution for a situation that you you didn't even thought is possible. The Fool and the Empress, two major arcanas. And look at here, the Fool is going into a direction and the Empress is going to another. So that really speaks here because look at this, King of Cups looks to the Empress. Abundance, growth. So something here, whatever it's given now, because full moment it's now, is going to ex exceed your expectations, are going to improve, are going to expand. Wow, okay, Queen of Pentacles. This is something related to your work or the environment of your work or in general related to your finances what's the tower here for because i feel here it's it's coming like you you don't see how this is gonna work or how this is gonna move what's the tower here for 
chariot something here it's about to expand movement chariot clarify the tower is whatever here is given to you it's like a push forward it's like a push forward you know like some somebody is telling you well why you stay there let's do the other thing it's kind of a, a push to you if you kind of waiting for something to happen or there's a you are at the moment that i don't know should i go or should i stay definitely there is a lot of push forward next to the chariot one more card sun wow so this is a new venture new energy for you like a renewal into your your situation whatever that is the number 13 something here speaks to you for some of you this person could have uh, water in the chart sun in cancerian sun in scorpio or sun in pisces so somebody here it's giving you that energy of till here move forward it's time whatever here it's time darlings uh, underneath i do have the the knight of pentacles we used to have the queen of pentacles so something here indeed speaking of work if was moving is gonna start faster okay why this person comes in here and what's the reason they are here was this person here and was the reason they are coming in here hermit they look into a situation deeper and they feel like you will benefit the most whatever here they are gonna give you one more card temperance it's kind of this person um, it's kind of they sense you need help it's like this person is like a saver for you whatever it is for some of you it's your self trying to get over a situation it's kind of looking to to the matter from a different perspective or from a deeper perspective something here is like universal wise needs to be balanced needs to be given and plain and simple they they feel the need that's what they want to do they want the um, they have to do three of wands there's somebody here who who believe in you that you can more whatever that in energy speaking of because this person sees differently than you do because I'm, I'm getting the energy you them you them for some of you it could be you and your own guides but it's some some kind of deep energy that I should move forward I should do this or I should do better or I should pursue forward whatever that is what's this five of swords what's about this people for some of you this person is it's sent to you to help you to get away from some kind of energy or some kind of people five of swords magician four of cups knight of cups nine of cups and knight of pentacles and queen of pentacles nine of wands okay so there's some kind of energy i feel here for some of you sagittarius you have more than one person who tries to help you could be person could be souls because I feel here there's some some kind of help, which Spirit says this is divine help. 
that we want to help you. And there are some sages here very stubborn that I don't need your help or I don't need any help or I don't want to and things like that. Why you feel so that you don't need help? It's kind of like some of you, you feel like you got into, you need to get into. Sometimes you can get even quicker. Was the Eight of Swords clarifier? Two of Swords. For some of you, you are very stubborn here where you feel like I is not the time to help. Five of Pentacles. Nine of Swords. And Eight of Cups. It's kind of like due to a further, deeper look, you definitely are going to move forward. Because I definitely see here you are going to move forward. Because you are going to realize it's time. And deep down, you know why. Wow. Okay. what this person has to to offer next or what's next in for you it's like this person moves you from a situation or from an environment to a it's like from a very from a very heavy environment to a very growing environment the empress energy here speak to me the de devil, wow. This speaks about great finances here. Especially for those of you who are in an environment where you are not paid well or good or to your value. These are good money. These are big money. Because devil next to, to the empress in this context are great finances. Very material energy here. Ace of Wands. Wow. Very quick even. Lovers. And Seven of Pentacles. It's kind of, it's a shift of energy here, darlings. Whatever here you are going to do or go, definitely this arm. This is a great income. Great outcome for some of you in a situation but also for some of you if you try to do in a in a certain way this person it's shifting because sometimes when certain things doesn't work definitely needs to be shifted and this person it's crucial it's like that pivot moment pivot person that catalyst person sent to you Okay, what else Spirit has to bring here and tell you? Two of Wands. Of course, this person is here to help you, but it's only you to make a decision. But it's kind of on the other side, on the 3D level, this is a decision made. So take your time to decide what you're going to do, what you want to do, and then go ahead. King of Swords. So here we are, loves. You are in the page and getting into the king. This person is in the page and is in the king. For some of you, as I said, for some of you, this is you. Being in the energy of I done that, I know that, now it's time. It's my time. It's like the shift. You see here we have the sun and we have the moon. So it's, it's definitely our, a vibration that you... Why is telling me here that you never thought this is something that you would like to or have to? For some of you might say, well, I will never do this or I never go to study this thing or do this kind of job. And now you feel it's at something here that I, I definitely would like to. 
definitely would like to or it's a try out somebody here might even tell you try out see if works or see if it's good for you and with the tower moment actually it's something that well I would like to go further more or more and more what advice we have loves what advice we have for you for this time period in this month also mid-month energies could be as you see this video till the end of the month what advice do we have from spirit to you Sagittarius death it's like a time that was struggle it's over death energy Scorpio plutonian energy here it's done and over and it's time to get to get that wish fulfilled something here it's ending because you are moving not to the next level but it's kind of 10 levels up whatever that 10 levels up is it's given to you look at here a new a lot of people now say in my teacher era in my school era but now it will be in your own era in my Sagittarius era kind of a thing five of wands whatever here you are gonna change a lot of people will want to be around you or want to surround you or whatever here is for example you start a new job or start a new thing many people will want to be doing what you do king of pentacles because it's kind of whatever you go there where money stands for you or the finances or the stability look at here four of wands incredible so here we are darlings spirit says Embrace this change because this is the level you always were looking but you kind of didn't see that works or you can go for. Okay. Whatever the energy is. But whatever it's opening up for you were not open for you probably never. That's what I'm hearing. But here it is. A wish to be fulfilled for others of you if you were hesitant to to leave a job or a career whatever here it's coming from whom it's coming you you don't expect such a turnaround this is something that you feel like not even in my wildest dreams I am um, I could see but yes you could so Sagittarius never say never certain things come to you quite obviously and keep an eye open or keep both or keep more even the, the third eye also open See you loves. I thank you so much. Till the next time. Bye for now.